The borders of both town and gown, therefore, are themselves racialized. And minority faculty members and their activities simply don't fit assumptions regarding civic engagement, particularly by university administrators. In addition, the place of public scholarship, such as widely read books, op-ed pieces, and media activity, gets undervalued if it's presented in minority newspapers, Spanish language media, or public readings in minority communities, as opposed to the New York or the Los Angeles Times and the white suburban outposts of culture. So the situation, I think, reflects, in short, the inability of some chairs, deans, provosts, presidents, to sometimes see beyond their own racial condition and truly understand and reward efforts by faculty members of all backgrounds toward service to the community and to the university. What is the public? I'll tell you just an incredible experience I had um, at USC that kind of opened this up for me. Um, in 2006, I was involved with a group of faculty in our School of uh, Policy Planning and Development. And the conversation, it was an email conversation as they were planning a grant about why Latino, the Latino community in Los Angeles was not civically engaged. So these are all people who were on board to civic engagement. They were working communities. They wanted to really know, why is this Latino community not that civically engaged? And they were, their, their evidence was the lack of participation in Los Angeles' neighborhood councils. Okay? This was happening in the spring of 2006. And literally, the conversation was happening all week. And on Saturday, in 2006, May 1st, 2006, was the largest single march ever on the streets of Los Angeles for immigrant rights. Now, all week, if you had been listening to Spanish language media, you knew this was going to happen. You may not know it was going to be that large, but the conversation was happening all week. All this sort of interesting energy happening. Uh, students, high school students generating this. Um, and so almost a million people march on that Saturday, all the while my colleagues were having this interesting conversation all week about how Latinos are not civically engaged. <laughs> so Monday morning, I just, you know, I type a little email to the whole group and I say, hmm, I wonder if we have to rethink our assumptions here, right? Um, there is a way in which our disconnection to these communities. And by the way, this is the majority of Los Angeles. So I'm not talking about minority communities, I'm talking about the majority of the city and how we can effectively do research and think about who is the public? Who is our public? So the situation I think reflects in short the inability of some chairs, deans, provosts, presidents, to sometimes see beyond their own racial condition and truly understand and reward efforts by faculty members of all backgrounds towards service to the community and to the university. What is the public?